Hey man, what good YouTube man? Today we watch, we reacting to um cheaters getting caught. I do it. Pretty ridiculous. I guess this guy is cheating with Pizza Hut. My boyfriend. Cheating with Pizza Hut. Sell to millions of people online with Shopify social media and marketplace integrations. You can sell your friend out of the car. Why is Pizza Hut FaceTiming you? Because it's not Pizza Hut. And they FaceTime you? Alright, so then you wouldn't mind if I answer. Oh, oh shit. Now, there's actually a saying that goes that men suck at cheating because sometimes they're just too dumb with it. I mean, who names this person Pizza Hut? Hey, they could not text me. I don't care, bro. You're I'm just telling you, I didn't. I'm just telling you, bro. I didn't cheat on you, bro. I was trying to make myself. I was trying to find Sorry, myself. Bro, please cancel my flight. Bro. I miss my cousin and I miss my grandma, bro. I'm God, like it, it wasn't even like that, bro. I never did no shit like that, bro. You know I didn't, bro. I miss my grandma, so I went to fuck Bree. Like, what the fuck? All right, I'll talk to you later. I'll talk to you later about Rangers. Cancel my flight, please. Cancel my flight, because I'm not... So I'm not sure if you guys understood that correctly. I guess this man is actually cheating on his girlfriend with his own cousin. Out of all people to cheat with, no. you gotta choose uh, her. Cheer, 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 cheer. When they catch you at BJ. They can definitely tell this woman's trying to get a reaction out of this other woman, but I guess there's actually women out there that are perfectly fine with dating other men who are already taken. What if he does the exact same thing to you? Have you ever hooked up with two people in the same night? Yes. Wow. It was one at the beginning of the night, one at the end? Yeah, yeah, I got bored. The first one didn't do it for you. first one didn't do it for you. had to go for a round two. Yeah, had to go for round two. It's pretty sad to realize that there's going to be a man out there that's actually going to look at this woman and decide to marry her. This is someone's <laughs> future wife. A lot of you have said, ah, what I'm doing, it's not really good, and it's there's all these bad problems. Mm -hmm. Did anyone ever say that? Anymore. Does anyone here feel that what they're doing right now is derailing them from being from the, with the person they're supposed to be with in the end and no. the life that they're supposed to well, end up with? No. Does no I'm not saying in the like end. No. I'm not saying in the end. I'm saying right now. So I think at least some of you. But, would. but none of us. If we're not one, looking for a long-term relationship yeah. right now, how does that even make sense? We don't want that. We're not looking for that. All of us are literally saying the same thing. You're not looking for it. The uh, one of you just said that you know, look, it takes a while to have a relationship, and maybe it might take a couple of years of dating, and then you get engaged. And then, so these things don't happen overnight. Really, what happens is people tend to just keep going down the roads that they're on, and they the habits that they cultivate become the habits that define their lives, whether it's virtue or vice. And I I just think if you believe you're going to keep doing this. And then one day at 34 and a half, you're going to wake up and say, you know what? I'm going to do something totally different now and get Mr. Wright, who's not addicted to porn, and get two kids and millions of dollars. I just think that's very, very unlikely. I think okay. it's more likely that all of us are going to find, like, some hot, rich guy to marry and take care of us than to, like, be single for the rest of our lives. <laughs> <laughs> Because we've set those standards for ourselves, so we're not going to accept, like, anything less. Now, if she really thinks she can continue doing OnlyFans, then at the end of her life, she can choose to marry a high-valued man and settle down with him, she's absolutely delusional. The only reason she feels that way is because of what social media has done to her and the fact that there's some sims paying for her OnlyFans. Wait till they're not young and not getting all of this attention anymore, then they'll start to really realize bro, how big bro, of a mistake they made. Seeing majority of my friends be married now and have kids, like, it's kind of been like a slap in the face where it's just like, I thought we all were on the same page, you know? Oh my God, traitors. We were all gonna be lonely forever strong queen i mean did you really think all of your friends were actually gonna stay single these women love preaching about how they're gonna be single the rest of their lives but immediately regret it the moment all their friends get cuffed and i guess have kids change my life check no why would i <laughs> I would have bad that car. You, you bellin'. I would have broke the window some of it. Imagine catching your best friend with your own girlfriend. Not only that, in the backseat of a car. That's Easily crazy. the worst shooting clip on the list. Does your dad know you sell your body to strangers on OnlyFans for $50 and you only got one like? Congratulations. You played yourself. Maybe if she lowers her prices at the cost of a McChicken, she'll actually start to get more sales. All right. If I wanted a boyfriend right now,
If these women really think they're gonna be able to call a high-valued man who has a bunch of options and immediately start dating them, they're sadly mistaken. The well, men they want have a bunch of other women also talking to them. Sure, you might be able to get a simp or some random dude in your DMs that's just gassing you up, but that's not the kind of dude you want. You want that special guy that every other woman wants. Yeah, okay, it take Bobby. time. It take time. You feel me? Better answer this: the PS5 or me? Pick one. That's one of the most stupid questions I've ever heard. No. Sorry, but OnlyFans detected, so opinion rejected. If you, you're with the exactly, you're with the married man. And if you haven't done anything, you haven't done anything. That's why you were hiding in the room like a little. Mm. Look at how you are, you. I'm not sure why she's only taking her anger out on the women when her husband's literally right in front of her. He right, made yeah. the choice, so how about you blame him as well? This creepy 24-year-old won't got stop no beef snapping me. Girl, got beef I feel like that's mean. So? I mean, it's not my fault that he's in my phone being weird. No, absolutely not. You shouldn't have to deal with any creepy dudes in your phone. Yeah. So block him. It's really that simple. If it really was bothering them, they would just block them. However, nowadays, people are addicted to attention. And any attention is good attention. Hey, you guys a couple. It's my love of my life. Love of your life? Yeah. I'll give you $10,000 cash right now on the spot if your girlfriend kisses me right now. Yes. No. What? what? No, it's a lot of money. We don't need that money. Yes, we do. No, we don't. I'm working right now. Uh, okay, okay. My bad, my bad. $20,000 cash right now if she kisses me. Yes. No, you've already Whoa. cheated on me once. We're not going to mention that. Okay, okay. My bad, my bad. Final offer. $50,000 cash right on the spot. If you don't do it, I'm taking it and walking away. We need it. We can get a Lambo or something. Well, we can't. Yes. Like, you do this. See that tram over there? I'm jumping in front of that tram. Do it. I can't believe you. Do I get the money? Yeah, you got to kiss me first, though. Okay. Yeah. Psych, you ain't loyal. <laughs> it's pretty sad to realize that sometimes it could just take a yeah, random man in the street money. to pull up with a buttload of money and take your girl from you. If a girl's loyalty only relies That's on how crazy, much money bro. you have, it's not a woman you want to keep around. This is why you can't feel bad for people. So goof alert. The husband of the cop who was getting greased by the whole police station is saying that even though she did it behind his bro, back. she looked like. <laughs> Everybody just look at the picture. Look at her right now. Okay. He is still sticking beside his wife. If you didn't know, about five cops got suspended and up to 15 more are being investigated after it was found out that everybody was getting a piece of um, this female officer. I'm talking secret parties, inviting the wives to do curricular activities. Oh Ultimately ended up getting caught by surveillance camera, catching them in the um, gym oh, and workout stations in the police department. She was doing all this under her husband's nose. Hey. And this man literally just came out and said, I'm with it. I'm still sticking beside her. <laughs> Yo, stand up, man. Amazon is overcharging you, Bro. but I can show you how to avoid it. Don't Bro, spend another what? dime on Amazon. This man is a you watch this. Simp. Here, just check my balls. She took your balls. I'm honestly um, speechless Bro. over here. I can't believe there are some men who really are simps. She will never respect this man in her life, and she's going to continue cheating the rest of her life because she knows deep down that even if she sleeps with 25 other men, her man will be right there at home, never leaving her side. If she cheats, he belongs to the streets. Hi, what's your name? Ekin. For sure. What's your name? Ekin. Ekin. Nice to meet Ekin. Yeah. Kiss or slap? Slap. Slap? Go. No. Thank you. That wasn't very nice. Now her talking about that wasn't very nice. Approaching random men and asking them to do things to you on camera. She trolling. He probably young as hell too. They both probably young as hell. And he got her name Taddy. Good luck, bro. <laughs> Whoa. Nah. She ain't see that. She just touched her man like that though. Like the friend like just straight up. On her man neck. Nah. She ain't catch that shit though. Don't cry, don't cry, don't cry. Here, just take my ball. 
<laughs> not him getting his face tatted of her name. That's easily one of the dumbest things I think I've ever seen on the internet. The fact your relationship has the same odds as a coin flip, and there's a possibility that she might leave you, is pretty ridiculous. Now she knows deep down that you'll never leave her, even if she does mess up. Do you want to play two truths in the law? Sure. Sure. We're in Pearson's car right now. I have a hat on. And Andrew didn't fuck my girlfriend. What? You fucked my girlfriend. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. <laughs> Why would you even say that? Dude, I'm not Bro. dumb, I know. Pearson, did you tell him? I had to, man. It was fucked up. <laughs> dude, I, I would have had to sneak that nigga. I'm sorry, dude. You're not sorry. Yeah, my bad, guys. I wanted to add in a funny... Yeah, I'm about to turn this off. Uh, hey, man, I appreciate y'all for watching. I don't know what I just watched. Um, i catch y'all in the next video, man. Videos every day, man. Y'all already know what it is. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Roll to 15,000 subscribers, man. We lit. Let's do it. Okay.